your boy I'll be kinda shitty as your man Let's go back to only being friends Sorry girl, I hope you understand this yeah. Nope. Once again, you know what this video is about Because you clicked on the title and I don't really need to explain Um, It's basically just the first time I've been like Primark shopping Since like March because I haven't really gone out this whole of lockdown. I know we're not really in lockdown anymore, but my house is. Um, so yeah, that's all I'm gonna be showing in this video. Don't want this intro to be long, so make sure to like this video, subscribe if you're not already, comment, cause why not? I don't really care what the comments are at this point. Uh, <laughs> and follow my new Instagram and my Snapchat at also leave them down below. I'm just gonna start off by saying we're gonna ignore my makeup. I couldn't find my foundation and then my concealer's gone like five different shades on my face. I don't know why. My eyelashes won't stay on. The glue was dodgy. The lipstick's not even staying. I don't really know what's going on. So we're just gonna ignore that for today. Um, most of this stuff is Primark, but some of the stuff isn't. Um, <laughs> but it's like all cheap stuff, realistically. Like it's stuff you can just like buy like yeah well i'll explain um you had you 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 could you do you you want you. um so the first thing i got which i'm not going to be showing this one but um i generally got this swimsuit because we're going away for my sister's and my mom's birthday and i realized i didn't have like a full length swimsuit so i got this because it was only like five pounds in Primark, it's not it's just like a standard black swimsuit. Um, yeah, I just thought it'd be easy because I didn't really want to go and spend like £20 on something that I'm only going to wear once. And if it's crap, it's crap. I'm only going to wear it once. Got myself some white cheap socks. Like, when you go to Primark, when don't you buy yourself socks? Like, we all go to Primark just to buy socks and walk out with like 25 different items. I don't like Primark clues, so I'm surprised I even bought half this stuff. Like, I don't like buying stuff at Primark. I got myself some more socks, just black and white ones. Standard stuff. Um, I did get this jumper, right? It's just like a... It's actually a men's um, jumper. It's the men's large one, but I just thought it was kind of cute, even though it's plain. Because um, I could just pair it with, like black biker shorts or something do you know what i mean or just wear it as a white oversized jumper it's a bit see-through now that i'm look, pulling it up to the light but i guess for primark what else was i expecting and it was like it's only six pounds so yeah let's wear a white top under it and hope for the best because yeah it's actually kind of see-through but like i said it is primark so what else do I really expect? Um, I did get, even though I probably won't wear these running, it's just these Primark workout extra small running leggings. Um, I won't wear them running, but I feel like any other leggings, you get a see-through. You have to buy sports ones for them not to be see-through. And I didn't want to spend £30 on more running leggings. That I'm not going to wear to run. I just wanted a thick pair of leggings I could wear like in the car. You know what I mean. And they're only like £7. So. I was happy. And to be honest it wasn't my money. So I don't know why I'm saying I'm happy. My mum was happy. Um, <laughs> next thing I got. I'm just going to pull a load of this out. Because it's all tangled together. I got this belt. And it actually is just like a seat belt. I don't like it's like one of those ones that come on a pram, like on a baby's buggy. Um, but I thought it was kind of cute. It was uh, it was only five pounds, so can't go wrong with five pounds. Probably not going to be a very good belt. Like I don't even know how it works to be honest. Yeah, I've no clue. But it's just a belt, so. Yeah, it's actually kind of big now that I'm realising. That's massive. It's just like a one size fits all bell. But I suppose I can make it smaller, but that's just a bit annoying. 
um yeah for five pounds i think it's pretty decent it's kind of like it is strong it's not like a cheap belt and i'm now realizing i've probably got hair stuck on my on my face um yeah it doesn't feel cheap or anything like it does feel like a decent belt the only bit that feels cheap like the metal bit here is, doesn't sound cheap, but it's the plastic the metal here doesn't it has got plastic on so you probably can't see that but um but yeah the rest of it feels pretty decent to me i'm pretty sure these are men's as well yeah these are men's black joggers in size small if they didn't have an extra small and i was a bit annoyed and the only reason i got black joggers or even any clothes from primark is because i've been stealing all my siblings joggers like i'm currently wearing size 11 to 12 black joggers <laughs> because i have none like i genuinely just don't have any well like i do but they're ruined and like even these ones have got paint and just like a load of crap on them and like i said i'm going away for my sister we're not going away but we're like going on a weekend trip for my sister and my mom's birthday so i just wanted something i could wear because at the moment I, I'm, I just don't wear jeans i just wear joggers that's all i wear at the moment um and these were only five pounds the only i was just a bit annoyed they didn't have extra small but it and it's got kind of it's got a pocket at the back and i know that sounds stupid but none of my joggers have a pocket at the back and but and they oh my god and they have them at the front i didn't even realize that but oh my god are you joking it's got a hole in it <laughs> that's a bit annoying it's got a hole in the pocket It is Primark though, so and I guess I could just stitch it up. I'm not gonna stitch it up. Nobody, I just don't have time for that. The other pocket's fine though. I didn't actually realise they have pockets in the front until now. Um, so I'm happy because none of my joggers have pockets in for some reason. I, di I don't know why. Um, and I just kind of like the s the silver on the end. I don't know what it was, but that just caught my eye. I just like how the ends of the lace have got silver on. Because when they the string doesn't have anything stopping it from like unraveling if that makes sense they always get like tatty and kind of grim so yeah these lashes i love these i love these individual lashes um the glue is absolutely shocking don't put that stuff on your eyes it burns but the lashes themselves i like i actually really like them they're not like individual individual because it's actually like it's actually three individuals stuck together and then you stick those onto your when eye. When you put these on, it does actually look like you've got lash extensions rather than like strip lashes. And I feel like lash the look of lash extensions looks better, if that makes sense. So I got myself two packets because these are only a pound. And even though you're not supposed to reuse single lashes, I do reuse them. Not more, I only, so I wear them twice. I wear them and then when I take them off, I clean them and then I wear them again and then they go in the bin because I feel like if, if, if they're not ready for the bin why I put them in the bin if that like do you know what I mean if I can get another wear out of them I'll get another wear out of them pretty decent for two pounds I was happy um what else I got some moisturizer because who doesn't need moisturizer we, we all just need some more moisturizer in our life okay simple just get yourself some moisturizer and especially because it was only like a pound and these are usually like four pounds so yeah and i do usually use the nivea one but everyone keeps raving about this one and how it's really good for when you fake tan so i thought i might as well get it considering it was only like a pound what else i got myself more underwear because why not like i said we just need some underwear and i, I don't know why they're so bright i just picked them up and i was like i'm gonna get them even though they're massively bright so in total i ended up getting like four eight like 12 pairs of underwear that are cheap and yeah they're probably not even gonna last and probably gonna snap but oh well <laughs> i got more lashes because we always need more lashes <laughs> um these are just the two pound 3d vixen ones um i love these i wear them nearly every day my old pair lasted me like 40 wears and i know that sounds gross but i wash my lashes every time i wear them most people wear them like five times then wash them and stuff whereas i wash them every single time so you're only supposed to wear them like i want to say you're only supposed to wear them like 
15 to 20 times and I wore my old ones 40 times so that's why I've got these ones on that just aren't sticking and they're kind of grim and gross even though these cost me like six pounds was such a rip off but yeah I needed some new ones so I got two packets because they're only two pounds and I don't know why I didn't get two packets last time but yeah these are the lashes that I wore in my glow up video and my makeup did I do a makeup video no, in the glow up one where I did my makeup and everyone kept asking what lashes those were. So they're just the 3D Vixen ones. They're not massively fluffy, but they're kind of like subtle and long. They're almost like the Bambi ones from Doll. Um, I didn't actually get this at Primark. I got this at, I want to say Poundland. But it's just the limited edition shimmer body lotion. It's probably not even limited edition. They just use that as a branding thing. But it's just that H, that hashtag six brand. I don't even know what the brand is, but it's just the shimmer stuff. And I use this all the time. I don't know why. Not this brand, but I always use shimmer lotions when I, like, not even when I'm going out. Even if I'm just, like, going to the supermarket, I will put this on my, like, on my neck and stuff. Or if I'm even just chilling outside in my house in shorts i'll put this on because I ju it just makes me feel pretty okay when i put this on my tan just looks better and i just bit my lip if you noticed uh, <laughs> it just makes me feel better it is a moist it moisture if i could speak english it does say here moisturizers and conditions i really wish i could read Moisturise and conditions, leaving skin with an illuminating radiant glow. It does, it doesn't, probably doesn't do as amazing as it says. Speaking of fake tan, <laughs> I got the St. Moritz Instant Wash Off Tan with the Shimmer <laughs> Enhanced Shimmering One Day Tan for Face and Body. Um, this didn't come in a shade which was a bit annoying so i'm a bit scared it's not gonna actually be fake okay it's got green it's got green fake tan on the top which worries me um, um okay it looks pretty dark to be honest with you can you see that can I'm going to be left with this mark in my hand now. Um, and I'll forget to wash it off and everyone will think I'm weird. But I just got this for when, basically for at the weekend when I go away with my, when we go on our trip with my sister. Because I didn't want a fake tan, but for the evenings when I want to, if I'm wearing a dress or anything, depending on what we're doing, I just wanted this. And also for the time being, I just cannot be bothered to fake tan. The thought of having to sleep in fake tan is, just makes me want to throw up. So I just decided to get this. It was £4. I did just have the label, but I peeled it off. It was £4, which I thought was pretty decent, considering it's just the St. Moritz one. Yeah. Um. What else did I get? I then picked up... I didn't get this at Primark. I got this at Boots, but it needed... I needed to try this because it's absolutely everywhere at the moment. It's just the Elf Puttyless, Poreless Putty Primer um, with hydrating. I don't know what that word says, but I'll probably put a picture of it somewhere on the screen. Um, but yeah, I decided to buy this because I really want to try it. I'll probably do a video on me reviewing it pointlessly reviewing it but why not um i picked up this tea tree oil, tea tree essential oil in poundland as well oh did i get this at primark i think i might have got this at primark but if i didn't i'm sorry um i just love tea tree oil for my skin for my hair I'm, i like the smell of it so i just picked up it was only i'm pretty sure it was only like one pound or one pound fifty depending on where i got it if i got it at primark i feel like it was one pound fifty but I've got it at the pound and well it was pound because it was at pound. Um I did also pick up this Revolution lips la this lipstick liner. Satin Kiss lip liner. 
and I don't know what the shade is. Is a satin the shade? No, because I don't know, but I just got this dark one to match. I got a lipstick. I got this lipstick at Primark, which I've been obsessed with since like January, which is just the Uptown Primark lipstick. And I just got that as a lip liner to match because loads of people messaged me about me not using lip liner in my video and how I just use lipstick to line my lips. And that's probably why they go so dodgy so quick. But, I, okay, so I said I'd try it. But if I don't like it, this is such a waste of money and it'll be going in my sister's room and she'll probably never use it either. Um, I then did pick up more lashes at Poundland, just individual ones, like those single individual ones, because I like just putting, a, like, oh my God, there's one missing. There's one already missing, that's a great sign. Um, but I like just putting like two or three on the end of my um, lashes when I'm just kind of, if I'm going out for the day and I'm kind of dressed up but I don't want to put too much effort in or if it's sunny and I don't want to actually put on makeup. Um, and I feel like my eyelashes coming off, probably is. And this is just 50 individual lashes, 20 small, 20 medium and 10 large. And it comes with a glue which I probably won't use because it's from Poundland and I'll probably burn my eyes. So yeah, I then just got some wax strips because, yeah, they were like four quid, so. Right, this is my favourite, wait. The price of all my Primark stuff came to, and I haven't showed everything because some of the stuff was just like, was like shampoo and conditioner, which I couldn't be bothered to bring upstairs because I've already used it. Um, and what else? A body scrub which was just the big coconut oil that everyone talks about, the £3 one. Um, came to £86, which was shocking. It did shock me a lot, to be honest. Um, I feel like there must have been something else that I'm not saying. Look, my sister got two pairs of leggings, so that was like an extra 14 But my favourite part this whole entire video and you're all probably gonna hate these but i absolutely love them when i say i love them as soon as i saw them even though they're massively too big for me i had to buy them i've never seen something i've been so in love oh you don't understand you don't understand how much i'm in love with these everyone on here probably thinks i'm so stupid but they're in a large and usually i buy like extra small small if i'm pushing it um but these are actually from tk maxx they're just zara ones um it doesn't say how much they are apparently they were nine euros but i paid in pounds so yeah i don't really know is there another tag i'm not oh here here I paid six pounds, so I can't really complain. They're really long, but considering they're high waisted, and I like my high waisted stuff like high high waisted, they may as well be worn like it may as well be a top and shorts. I wear it that high. Um, I have already tried these on. That's why they're inside out. Um, and I absolutely love them. Absolutely obsessed with them. They look kind of weird when they're not on, to be honest. But I'll probably put a picture of me wearing them on here because I'm wearing them this weekend. But yeah, actually love them. Absolutely love them. Never been so happy in my life with a buy. Little purchase. Got the typical British girl body spray. Yeah, for like £2. It's just the Sweet Flora one in the So brand. That's what it's called apparently. Um, I don't actually like... Oh my God, there's hair in my mouth. I don't actually like this brand, this, I don't actually like the smell, but this brand, usually I buy their fresh mist, if I think that's what it's called, um, and I actually love it, I wear that all the time, and every time I wear it, people compliment me on how it smells, so I decided to pick this one up, because they didn't have that one, and it actually smells pretty rank, like, 
it smells like you know when you were like five and you'd be given like body sats and there'd always be that strawberry scented one in the box that you never want to, you'd never want to put on yeah you know what i mean it just smells rank absolute rank like i feel like people go out in this smell like people walk around smelling like this but to me if you're walking around smelling like this you smell like a 10p body care set that you got from christmas in my opinion so yeah and it lasts 36 months so that and then okay the main ingredient is alcohol which kind of worries me because usually the main ingredient in absolutely anything is water like even in fake time the ingredient yeah the main ingredient is water and fake time and this is telling me the main ingredient is alcohol which is worrying so probably why it smells so strong and why it smells so rank the last thing which I, it was another absolute amazing bag me i i've got fake tan on so I probably shouldn't be picking these up but it's just these dkny white joggers they're pretty see-through as you can tell but i did get them from tk maxx and the dkny so i don't know why they're see-through they're 16 pounds reduced from 20 so yeah i was happy they do just have what is it on the leg that it says dkny um and it's got big pockets in it so i was happy i just need to shut up like this video is so pointless but i was bored so yeah <laughs> and i'm losing my voice um that is everything i got pretty much except from like random bits like shampoo conditioner things like that um which i didn't really need to show you and i did spend like 20 pounds on like biscuits and loads of that random stuff but i feel like that's everything so yeah if you've made it this far and you're still watching this thanks because i'm now realizing how pointless this video is but, yeah um make sure to like this video if you have made it this far subscribe if you're not already would mean so much to me and share it because why not even if you're sharing it to be nasty i don't really care because it's a share for me so yeah um that's all i have to say so i'll see you next time